So there's the start list. For the men's 1500. Gunwoo has been impressive this weekend. Wong has certainly been very, very good. Soon Long has had a terrific weekend. You're kind of waiting to see if Jens Van Twotz will have this race and this event be kind of his breakout in this season. He's second from the right in your screen. And here we go, 13 and a half laps for the A final 1500 meter championship. Kim and Wong settling toward the back of the field. Schwalt sets the early pace. Yes, Metz, Soon Long. And Long will allow skaters to pass him. He'll fall back to about six right now. Now he'll kick it in. I think he wants to stay close to a couple of specific skaters. And now the two Chinese skaters to the front of the pack. Lee in the lead, Su Long in third, so sandwiched around Wang Da Hoon. Now back to Van Trout. And Janu now in front for Canada, inside the final eight laps. Just met last week's silver medalist, right now bringing up the back. Field Ingenue. Gantz Van Veld, one of the top skaters in the 1500 meters. The two Chinese waiting for their time. And, now and there's the move by Soon Long. Out in front. Ingenue second. Little bit of a gap as we get inside the final five laps. Desmet still at the back of the pack. And Wang Dae-hoon right now settling in the middle. He's in fourth. Ingenue reclaims the lead from Soon Long. Now the race really begins. Three laps to go, then Janu. Van Trout trying to hang in. Here's Wang Dai Hoon swinging a couple of skaters wide, and the two Chinese skaters stay inside. Final lap and a half, Wang Dai Hoon up to third. Still Don Janu though for Canada. Van Trout in the two position, a lot of contact on the inside. Dan Janu in the lead, here's the bell. Denzno around the corner, and he is going to get there ahead of Wong. Kim Gun Wu for third. There will be a review. There was some contact on that front straightaway with about two laps to go. But it is William Denzno of Canada on Montreal ice. Unofficially the 1500 meter champion. They're taking a look at a potential penalty against Stan Desmets against a skater from China. That's now been cleared, evidently. So there is William Antonio, the 22-year-old, who was ninth in this classification last year. And he's looking at a gold medal podium here in Montreal. Andrew just turned 22 years of age a couple of weeks ago. Got on his first individual World Cup podium last week when he took bronze in the 1,000. The only World Cup gold medals he has earned have come as part of the, the men's 5,000 relay. Last week here in Montreal and then last year in Almaty. And this will be a first for him. How about that? Flying high across the finish line. And a World Cup champion for the first time in his career. 